Welcome to ILA Speak Up 2022 Round 2. Greater voice, greater impact. This is the Big Bang CEOs from ILA Greenview. Let us introduce ourselves. My name is Jolie. My name is Lou. My name is Chloe. My name is David. And my name is Anna. Dear citizen, we are the CEOs of five different recycling companies. Today we will talk about our companies and what we made in our companies. We will also talk about our vision for the truly green future. Are you ready? It's showtime! Yay! Our company is called Save Our Souls. What we do is taking old shoes, nobody likes it by them anymore. We will give them a new life. Please allow me to tell you some facts. Food waste account is for is about 16% to 32% of fashion industry total pollution. It does harm to the planet in many ways. Our company will aim to, to solve this problem through a form of creative recycling called upcycling. First, we, share, we need to have old shoes and new shoes of all type and size and we ship them to our factories then we will try to fix them simply we try to give them a, a pair of a new pair of laces and decorate worn out of shoes with fabric paint we also cut off old shoes to collect usable parts to make com to combine into a new unique ones we hope we can consider pretty can reduce the number of shoes thrown away, therefore reduce the amount of plastic and textile pollution. And speaking of plastic pollution, do you know that plastic bottles are the third most collected plastic trash in the ocean? 90% of plastic bottles used aren't even recycled, but with our work, we can transform them to something useful. Pots for plants. Our company name is Plastipot, and this is how our company operates. We'll have a team of volunteers going around collecting bottles straight from your doorsteps. Then the bottle will be cut and drilled strips any labeled or stickers out and cleaned. Then we will drill holes inside of it for drainage and we will hand paint our own design on it with acrylic paint. By next, we will include a pack of seed, soil, and introduction for you how to grow your own plant. By doing this, we hope that our company will lower the amount of plastic bottles being thrown away, help the environment and instill a love of planting trees in our community. <coughs> Next up will be my company. My company is called Paper Products and we make products from waste paper. As you know, we're living in the age of constant <coughs> technological revolutions and the decrease in use of paper is expected. The decreasing use of paper is predicted due to this. However, that didn't happen, and the demand for paper is expected to double by 2030. Paper waste accounts for about 40% of the landfill area and are often burned, causing serious air pollution. That's why my company exists. The process begins with workers collecting paper waste from various places, such as schools, offices, hospitals, etc. Then, the paper will be transported to the mill. Here, the paper will be crushed to pulp, cleaned, removed impurities, whitened, dried, laminated, and reused again as notebooks, like this one. I believe that in this way, we can protect endangered forest resources, reduce landfill area, and reduce energy and water consumption. I also have a dream that one day, Vietnamese students will use our recycled notebooks to write. That's awesome, David. You know, I have a dream too. Ever since I was a child, I've always been fascinated by fashion. So each gown or mini skirt worn by me gives me great joy. So naturally, every time I feel a slight sense of grief, every time an old piece of clothing gets thrown away, 
An idea came to my mind. Why don't we recycle them into other products? My company is called Recycle Fashionista Recycling, and we do exactly this. Reproposing textiles from clothing and making them into fashion accessories. The best way to do them is to cut them into smaller pieces. From the laces from an old dress can be turned into a hair tie like this one right here. And for the big part of the dress can be turned into purses or pouches like these ones. With this recycling idea, we can hopefully reuse the material for longer and reduce the amount of resources to make these materials. And greetings to all the nice people. I'm CEO of a, of a company named Kitsy Friendly. Did you know that Carbo is one of the most frequently used material in the modern world and has been for over a century? Around 80% of cardboard of products sold are packaged in cardboard. That totals 400 billion square feet of cardboard. These statistics have shown us that there is an urgent need for us to recycle cardboard. What makes it better to recycle than turning them into something fun and exciting like toys? How do we do it? Well, first, we collect cardboard boxes from our cardboard collecting centers from all across the country. Next, our team of designers will sketch out the drawings and cut out all the necessary materials. We will glue and assemble these parts and finally give them a nice coat of paint. Finally, we will distribute our toys back to our collecting centers so that people can buy whichever toys they want. Our vision is that many toys in the future will be made out of recycled cardboard. And with that, we conclude our speech. We hope that through these recycling ideas we've shared, we can encourage you to also recycle for a greener future to save the world. We are the best.